Okay, fired 100 times in a row now. Okay, now I've got 100 more chances left to get myself enough money to help my BFF Harrison store his extra rare Thomas and Friends items in a huge cabinet. Now, this is the 100th time I have been fired. Where should I work at next? I've got an idea. I'm going to work at Sweet Treats. Welcome to Sweet Treats. How may I help you? I would like to have an Oreo milkshake, please. Okay, I'll get that for you in... Wait, hold up. You're a cow. Cows give us milk and our ice cream is made of milk and you're ordering a milkshake. Since you're a cow, why not make the milkshake yourself? Why would I want to make the milkshake myself? I don't even work here. Correction, you do not work here, but you will become an employee so you can make your Oreo milkshake yourself. But I'm a cow and you're a steam locomotive. So does it really make any difference? I've heard many customers use this excuse already. They just need to start working more harder. Now, you are a cow, so you will get a job here and milk yourself to make milkshakes. No thanks, I don't even work here. Correction, you don't work here, so you will get the job yourself. Why don't you make the milkshake yourself? No thanks. Just, just, dang this sweet treats place. I'm heading off to Baskin Robbins instead. Bye bye, you steam locomotive tender engine. Bye bye, you dang cow. Leave me alone. Welcome to sweet treats. How can I help you both? Hey, hey Dodge, look. It's, it's a steam engine. Oh yes, Splatter. It's a steam engine. It's purple. And does it look like the one we, we, um, what was it again? I have no idea. Um, we help diesel tend to destroy. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, but this one has a tender, though. Um, of course I have a tender. What's wrong with it? Oh, it's just that the original engine we <sighs> tried to look for didn't have a tender, but she was still purple. Oh, brother. Look. I know I look like I'm female, and loads of people think I'm female, but in real life, I'm actually a male. Oh, right, sorry, it's just that the purple engine was female, the one we were helping Diesel 10 destroy. Okay, who exactly is this Diesel 10? I have no idea what you're even talking about. He's a, a British Railway class diesel engine uh, with a huge claw named Pinchy. A huge claw? Wow, wouldn't that be an illegal modification in real life? I mean, who would ever... 
ever invent a giant claw onto a diesel engine? Yeah, I don't think we've ever met you before. But you do look like a hybrid between a Thomas character and an Equestria girl's character. Oh yeah, yeah, <laughs> correction, I am based on, a per on an 8783 class locomotive and the face you are seeing, it has an Equestria girl styled look. Oh sorry, it's just that... We didn't know anything about Equestria Girls until he told us today. Um, okay, I hate to break it with you, but are you two actually going to order anything? You seem to be holding up the line a little bit. Oh, um, sorry, I think we'll head out now. Um, I don't know why we were here for. Oh yeah, they're the two diesel shunters of Diesel 10 who only appeared in Thomas and the Magic Railroad and they were originally going to return in Day of the Diesels and the Great Race but got dropped in favour of new characters. Hmm, that's a bit sad. <sighs> I don't know. Well, I think I'm just going to go find somewhere to look for my 102nd job now. I wasn't really enjoying this job anyway, if I'm being honest. So, I'll see you all next Friday at my 102nd job. Bye! <laughs>